Hello guys, welcome to another vlog. Hi guys. Right yeah. guys, different video for you today. We are doing a food money challenge. How much can you get for five US dollars? We've got 180, we're gonna round up to 190 baht, which is current right now. Let's see how much food we can get for 190 baht. Come on, let's go. <laughs> From what I see already, there is a lot of food. There is some shopping, clothes shopping to do as well. Cheers! This is gonna be a weird one guys <laughs> They look quite hot Ow, it's all over your mouth <laughs> Hey guys, if you're new here, we are Danny and Diggy We came to Thailand with a plan to travel for one year But things have changed I love this place We fell in love with this country and now Bangkok, Thailand is our new home Yay! <laughs> Follow us if you want to see how beautiful this country really is There will be a lot of good food on this channel Friendly locals <laughs> and some great places Thailand has to offer. Welcome to another vlog. We are in Samut Prakan. We are going to spend five dollars in a local market. We are in a black market. Let's see how we get on. Let's go. Let's go. You want some? 35 baht for an you ice want? cream. But it's not really in our budget, is it? Maybe I'll come back for that later. 35 baht for an ice cream, soft ice cream. That's really good. So this market is not touristy market, guys. We are in Samut Prakan. We're the only phalanx here. We're the only foreigners here at the moment. <laughs> but yeah, from what I see already, there is a lot of food. There is some shopping, clothes shopping to do as well. It's really cool. Yeah, they got like a whole bar seating area. You sit down and have your food. There's lots of food around. And the prices, they're really good. So we'll show yeah. you in a minute, minute, guys, what the prices like. But beer is not in our budget today, guys. Are you <laughs> Sorry, Danny. So, first snack is Kanam Krok, 40 baht. I'll show you how many in a minute when we go to eat it. But yeah, with these Kanam Krok, you've got loads of different flavors. You can have taro, you can have chives, you can have coconut. So, loads of flavors. We're going just for coconut this time because we love coconut. Oh, they smell so good. So, you get six for 40 baht. Mm -mm. These are really good. What you're looking for is they should be crispy on the outside. The inside they're actually gooey and runny and soft and really sweet. Oh, so tasty. Yeah, 40 baht for six. Mm. First treat. Mm. All right, Matt. <laughs> These are so good. Literally, the coconut is coming out. Coming out, guys, when you squeeze it, it's so good. Mm. Oh, yeah. My favorite. I want one more. Come on. <laughs> I think he's they hungry. are so he good. Likes these ones. And it's good to get them while they're still hot as well. Yeah. If you come to Thailand, guys, if you on holiday or you're traveling, or if you never tried this before, make sure you do. They're so good. Oh, no. I told you they stuffed inside. I've got it all over my boobs now. Next snack. 10 bar each for these. So this one is a chicken. So similar to Moo Bing, but chicken. 
I'm excited for these. Danny has just finished work, by the way. That's why he's wearing a bit weird clothes, guys, like a uniform, basically. <laughs> right, give me, give me. I'm so hungry. I only had breakfast, guys. Cheers. Mm. Oh, that's a good mooping. That's amazing mooping. Because not loads of fat on it. Sometimes you get a lot of fat. When they're cheap, you get a lot of fat. But these are 10 by each. Oh, so good. yes. Oh, this is so good. Oh. We will come back here and we will come back here for this mooping. It is so good. So that is 60 baht gone, guys. We have 130 left. <laughs> okay. So we have... We have... Nung Song Sam. We have Roy Sam Si Palet. Mango sticky rice, guys. Behind us is mango sticky rice, 20 baht. That is so cheap. Oh. We definitely would get this, but we had mango sticky rice yesterday, guys. <laughs> but like around where we live, mango sticky rice is around 60 baht, mm. maybe 80 baht sometimes. Yeah. And that wasn't a small portion neither. No. So 20 baht for that is like at least over half a mango with the sticky rice. Really good. sure what that is guys looks interesting is it uh, uh, it put pasta and green <laughs> right so this was 25 bar this is gonna be interesting one guys because this is tamarind uh, it's like an esteemed in a steamed dough and then you have coconut milk on top you have chilies and fried garlic as well. It's a bit of a mix. It's like a sweet and savory in one, but I don't see yeah. how the chilies and coconut cream kind of go together. But we'll find it out. Because <laughs> we'll you out. put it in the curries. Oh yeah. I was yeah. Right. <laughs> this is gonna be a weird one, guys. We never tried this before. I have no idea how to eat this. We got coconut milk with it, so I'm just gonna pour it all over. Oh, that's good. Woo! <laughs> 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 mm. Oh, that is good. It's sweet though. Mm. Right, what we got here, guys? We have chilies. So I'm gonna go buy the chili first. Only half because they're super, super hot. Oh, yeah, they're hot. Well, food with tamarind, I think. weird I don't think I should have chilies with it or or garlic with it because this tastes like dessert guys and then you bite the chili it tastes really good but it doesn't work with chili and and garlic I think right let's go with the purple this purple beauty not sure what that is let's just go for it in one <laughs> this stuff is amazing but the chili ruined it for me 
because I've got such a I've got such a mixed emotions about this because my mouth is burning and I'm eating delicious delicious sweet dessert Danny you have to try this and give them your impression because this is so weird I don't know what to make out of it it's so good though I really don't understand this this dessert or this food because it tastes to me like dessert I'm so confused right now I love it but I'm super confused I know you try it Danny yeah so for what I saw they're wrapping up I think it's sweet and tamarind and they're wrapping it like in a, a dough a really thin dough kind of flour maybe with rice flour it's very thin and cooked really quickly. It's kind of steamed under a little tin hood. So I'm going straight for the balls. Let's give it a go. I'm going to miss the chili. Maybe yeah, I'm meant to chili. chase it with chili. I'm not too sure. Let's give it a go. Maybe too much sweetness. That's weird. The inside is quite chewy. The actual flour and pancake I thought was thin. It's a bit gelatinous, it's a little bit thick, but it's nice. I just don't understand the lettuce and the chilli. It, does, it doesn't really go, but with that coconut milk, mm, really good. Just don't have the chilli and don't need the lettuce, it doesn't seem right. But really good, yeah, really good. 25 baht, come on guys, just try it, 25 baht. How much we got left? Oh. Mm. We have 105 baht left, so for this market, this is going to go a long way, so let's go find some more treats. Let's go. That looks so pretty, it's done really nicely. Check that out. Wow. Oh. But it's a bit of our budget for a yeah. sweet treat. 100 baht. Yeah. These are the onion in it and chili. Sadika. Those ones, those bugs, they had like onions and lots of herbs in. They might actually be quite nice. You wanna try it? Yeah. <laughs> Would you like to see us eating bugs, guys? We can try it, but you have to leave a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> Literally can get everything done in this market. They even have optician guys. That's why I love Thai markets because you can actually come to one and you get everything done. You got a night out and shopping done. Yeah. What did you want to say? It's like a proper optician. They have all the gear yeah. there, like in a little tent, like in a normal market. They yeah. Got a proper optician so I know where to go next time yeah. <laughs> right need a drink is super hot my favorite green tea in the other video I showed you my favorite green tea guys in Thailand this is amazing <laughs> it's so good <laughs> Just so you guys know, I just asked the price of a large beer. 75 baht for a big bottle of beer. Ah, uh, look at the size of this drink, guys. This is in the size of my head. <laughs> so, so refreshing. Try this green tea if you're in Thailand, if you see it anywhere. You're gonna love it. That's one off? That's it? Mm. Yeah having some waffles and I've gone for the pineapple jam because I love the pineapple jam and Diggy's gone for the normal chocolate 10 baht each, 20 baht gone we've got 60 left oh, yeah. I think waffle, waffle. people are so nice here guys they're super friendly so what's waffle in Thai? waffle waffle so same same <laughs> I want a waffle there you go chocolate Get this one. Mm. Oh, for 10 baht, it's so, so cheap down here. 10 baht for a waffle? Yeah. It's all over your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. Soft and crispy on the outside. It has like a sugar 
crispy glaze on the outside as well. It's so good. <laughs> Mine is just a pineapple jam. So in Thai, it's and it's just basically a massive wedge of jam on top of the waffle. Oh, that waffle is good. It's not heavy. It's not dense. Sometimes back in the UK and. England is a bit dense and a bit heavy. These are really bubbly and fluffy and light. So light. Mm. Hello, am I? Yeah, I can eat like three, four of these. They're good. Ten baht each. Bargain. So good. Mm. We're getting some fish bowls now in a spicy sauce. It's hot. Yeah. It's run, run. From that. Yummy? Really good. If you don't like spice, it is a little bit spicy for you guys. This is like something one. like Nam Jing seafood. Yeah. I think it's just blend, right? Yeah, it's blended up. Blended, yeah. Right. But it's a little bit spicy. Yeah? But nice spice. Yeah, it's a nice spice. Mmm. Not too hot. Hello, <laughs> ma. And the fish balls are really good, they're really soft. There's no, um, so sometimes you get soft. bits of them, a bit of gristle, a bit of bite. These, no. nothing, really good. Nice, light and so soft. The sauce is a little bit spicy, tiny bit of spice. You can taste a lot of coriander there. That's that good. It's so good, it's nice and refreshing, lemony. Try fish balls with some seafood sauce, guys. So yeah, seven balls for 35 baht. 35 baht. So good. Yeah. We're getting a lot of food and we still got... I'll count up in a minute for you guys. See how much <laughs> we got there. All right, guys, we've only got 25 baht left. So we want a proper budget now. Let's find something for 25 baht or less. Let's go. Spend it wisely, Danny. Mac. Right, we only had 25 baht left, so we've gone for gyozas, they're 10 baht a piece, chicken gyozas. So we've got 5 baht left guys, but it might be a bit hot. These look super crispy and they look quite hot. Ow. Mmm. Very hot, but really nice, super crispy. It doesn't taste the oil as well, but it's the chicken. It's got herbs in it as well, like chive. Oh, they're good. Actually, probably better with the sauce. We should get sauce with them, but these are so good. Well, now we will have to find something which is gonna cost five bar. <laughs> Let's go. Mmm, Oh, it's so good. Mmm. Danny, mm? we have to find something now which costs five bar. I'm sure we can find it here anywhere we find something for five baht, but I don't know what yet. Yeah, we have to look hard. I don't think that you're gonna. Uh. Uh. Oh, ah. <laughs> we're down to five baht. So these are two baht each. So we're gonna have one left. One, two. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Thank you so much, Kaponka. So these, you probably know what these things are, guys. They're little crispy pancakes, and you have egg white beaten up with sugar, and you have egg floss as well. Two baht each, and the lady was so nice, she gave us three for five baht. So, we've done it. Let me try this. Mmm, I like that. Mmm, they're good, really good. These are called Kanon Bua. Chai Mai? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> oh. So good. Mm. Super tasty, guys. Oh. They're so nice because they are bite sized, guys. So you're just not gonna get messy. Shove it in your mouth, and it's so good. Heaven. Mm. Oh yeah. Mm. She actually gave us four in the end because she let us try another coconut one. So yeah. for five baht, we should have only got two. We got double the amount. Right, guys, we did it. 
five dollars in one market. We had a lot of food. Yeah, I think we didn't show you, well, we didn't eat proper, proper food, but we just want to show you what you can get for five dollars. How so, much food you can get for five dollars yeah. in the local market. But in this market, there is mukata, there is buffets, and it's still really reasonable price. So, if you want to come to this market, come and check it out. It's such good value and good price and tasty food. Yeah, location link is in description, guys. So if you want to find it, make sure you follow it over there. Thanks for watching. Leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video because we had a lot of fun and let us know what other food we should try in the future guys what do you want us to try not durian please <laughs> <laughs> subscribe thumbs up and see you next one cheers Bye. guys